Uh, Wicca is a relatively new religious movement. Um, it's not hundreds of years old or thousands of years old. Uh, Wicca as such is um, probably got started in the 1950s in Britain. For the first time this year, members of the Covenant of Gaia Church of Alberta are speaking to media about their holiday, Samhain. So this year we decided that we wanted to uh, try to come forward and tell our story a bit so that uh, people would learn a little bit more about who we are and what we do and that we're really just people like everybody else. Samhain is one of eight holidays celebrated in the Wiccan faith. It also falls on the same day as Halloween. Samhain is a Celtic holiday. Halloween is a modern children's festival. And that's, that's really, it happens to have on, be on the same, same day, but honestly, they don't have a heck of a lot in common. Um, it is the day of the dead for us, where we remember the people who have died in the past year. Um, it's not, how can we dress up and, and get tons of candy? So really, there, there's not a lot of overlap. The rituals they perform on Samhain are private. However, they did share with us a spiral dance. The spiral dance can be performed in large or small groups and can include singing and dancing, or they can be done at a slower meditative pace. When we're doing the spiral dance, we're just uh, kind of clearing our minds and um, working on just getting into a, a spiritual space where we can just be. So we won't be thinking of anything specific. We're not thinking of anything specific. We're just enjoying being in nature and uh, thinking about this time of year and what it means to us. There are many misconceptions associated with the Wiccan faith. Many have thought of them as witches. While there may be a connection long ago, most aren't connected now connections there, the groups of traditional faith healers and such in the English countryside that would have been called witches are one of the channels through which we do have a bit of connection to the ancient history. So it's through those women and those faith healers and those wise men that we have a little bit of a connection to the past and what their, through their knowledge we kept some of that past. So while kids are out trick-or-treating this Halloween, members of the Wicca Church will be gathering strength for winter and mourning loved ones who passed away. For Go, I'm Kate Hutchinson.